Hey, good morning, guys. Coffee time. Coffee. Good morning, Natsa. Let's have a coffee together. Mm? Sunday morning. It's a beautiful day outside. Morning. Portugal, Canada, Ma Malawi. Good morning. I see nothing, you know, it's just coffee time. Uh, morning, boss. Morning. Let's have a coffee. Gustavo, good morning. That one here, not so sunny. Yeah, it's a nice weather here around London. Are we repairing any? No, not today. Today is Sunday, man. It's, you know, we have to chill. Silvio Nazza. Uh, good morning. Australia, Poland. Good morning, guys. I'm, my, I'm halfway through my third Americano, same here. This is my third Americano. Morning, Natsa. Natsa, Daniel. So, how is everyone? Hmm? I didn't get any picture with the uh, with the chipset, so I think I will do a video today. Maybe someone can answer on that question: which chipset is good? Thank you, Mtech, for uh, letting us uh, let us know. Diane, buona sorrente faccio bene. Am o cafe de dimineața acum. Morning. I want you to ask you if you read books. I stopped reading books a while ago. I mean, if you are speaking about tech, you can see everything on this. It's on YouTube or Google in those days. And, you know, it's very easy to understand if you're looking for something, you check a video, you can find out very quickly how the things work. But otherwise, I wish I have time to read books. Good morning. Morning, guys. Oops, so good morning. Coffee time. Yeah, let's have a coffee. So let's see what everyone is working. Hmm? Or everyone is chilling on Sunday. You know, I'm curious how many people actually uh, are here because they are repairing 
or or how many people are here just because okay i can see this uh, like a possible future like maybe in the future i will start doing some repairs and i know you can start a poll on youtube i don't know how <clears throat> i don't know how can i start a poll but diana knows one second no yeah 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 you we can do it yeah i do repair thing is uh, okay maybe maybe it's the one i do repair stuff stuff yeah uh, um I'm only interested. Huh? What do you think about that? No, one sec. What, what do I do here? One second. No. Okay, so this is one. And we have yes, no. Okay, only interested. I love coffee. <laughs> no, no, no. I am here. I am here for the coffee. Yeah, yeah. Is better? Maybe I'm just watching. Yeah. Only watching, interested. Watching, what? Watching. Yeah? So it's okay, we can start this poll. All above. We don't have another option. I cannot add other other option. But we have yes, no. Yeah, but no. It's with only watching interested. It's not good. Delete no option. But how can I delete it? I have no option to. Wait, I can rename it. Huh? Yes, I can. Yeah, that's great. All above. It's fine like that? Change the question. Okay. I am here because because no, I'm here because okay, so here I'm repairing stuff better now. I fix stuff, I'm repairing stuff, same thing, better now. That's fine. Start poll. Okay, let's see. Yeah. Let's see, actually, how many people are actually repairing things from uh, from here. You know, just curious. Yeah, yeah, yeah you got it. Okay. Yeah, my my cat just learned how to open the door. Okay. I'm here for overcomplicated polls. Ha. I started motherboard repairs because of you. No, listen. If anyone 
said, I start a business because of you. That's not true. Yeah, you can start. And I said that many times. You can start a computer business without this channel. And I can assure you, m- probably most of the computer business from UK, they are not watching this channel. So you don't need this channel in order to have a computer business. Yeah, you have windows, you have hard drives, you have screens, you have keyboards, and then you have the phone parts. You can run a business without this channel. What you can do from this channel, you can actually probably at least double your income, you know, uh, just start doing some motherboard repairs. That's what I believe. I believe you can at least double your your income. And if you are on this channel from the beginning and you see, let's say, most of the videos, you should be able to carry motherboard repairs. <laughs> uh, yeah, doctor uh, EAMS. Uh, probably you are not the only one. Probably you are not the only one. <laughs> probably you are not the only one. No, definitely you are not the only one. Horst, what do you mean, man? Horst, what do you mean? Only repair things for friends, no commercial. How do you think everyone started? Hmm? Like, oh, let's open a shop. No, everyone started with small things, fixing stuff for friends, family. And then you realize, wait, I can go big. Huh? That's how everyone started, uh, Horst. That's how everyone started, even myself. So you are just on the beginning, yeah? You are before going commercial. Start an electronic repair course. I'm ready to pay. That's the worst things what you can do, to pay for a course when everything is free on YouTube. And you course with what? With everything is on YouTube. I mean, there are over a thousand videos covering different folds. Why can I speak more on a course? Uh, Benjamin, I'm not sure. I never used that uh, Ihuma air station, so I cannot have an opinion. Uh, Ken, had a repair shop in Melbourne, Australia, for almost 15 years. Yeah, can but you you can restart it, yeah. Like how I said, <coughs> and I have so you understand where I work, where I work for like ten years, I had a shop, and like twenty meters, twenty meters from our shop was another shop. Now those people was running a successful business and not even having a multimeter, a computer business, computer and phone business without a multimeter. And they are not the only ones. I've seen a lot. And when I'm in a successful business, they can afford to have employees, they can afford to, you know, <clears throat> do different promotion and stuff. Just, you know, doing the... Actually, you think, okay, motherboard repairs is like a, a high revenue. No, most of the repairs are not motherboards. Most of the repairs are hinge, screen, hard drive, keyboards, batteries, laptop. Then on the phones, you have the same. Screens, battery, charging ports. Yeah. The shop, I, I, what I work, where I work before, do you think the shop closed because I left the shop? No, they are doing great. They are not doing motherboard repairs. I mean, if they have something, they send it to me. But, you know.
Well, Ken, maybe it's time for a new start. Yeah, a new start on a new uh, area, you know, because, yeah, area probably matter. You want on a busy area, check what kind, kind of business, computer businesses are around. But there's no way, I can't believe, I can't believe you cannot make this thing, this to work. In a country like Australia, I can't believe it's not going to work. You can do it from home. If you are uh, if you are looking to stay on your comfort zone, yeah, you can do like me. Just do a website. And you know what I'm, I cannot do? No, listen. I got like few days, like under one week, I got like over 100 reviews on Google Business. Very simple. And the people are coming based on the Google. You are getting advertised by Google based on your location. Of course, they close my business, my Google business account because I don't have actually, uh, I, I don't have an address on my, on my website and I cannot put an address there. But yeah, you can do it with Google business. Yeah, Google business. That's important. Google business, website, then you are good. Yeah, that's a lot of money, 100k per year. Actually, it's no more it's no more expensive compared with here. It's about like here, like what the owner paid. What's on the menu? Repairs for today? Coffee, Roland. No repairs. It's Sunday. What do you mean? I earn 60% from Google Business. You see? You see? You see exactly what I told you. Because it's very easy to get uh, Google reviews. They are not uh, check the reviews. You just you know you just got them. You can ask people to give you reviews. The customer you say the customer. Okay, I give you five pounds discount. Just let a review about what you feel. You know you, you don't have to tell them to lie. You know just to let the review. No pizza today. Nah, we had a, we have it yesterday. We can have a pizza today, yeah, if it's for free. I'm just joking. Uh, Socrates, that's a very tricky subject. Mm -hmm. We had on the shop, and uh, we had people, they didn't come to collect them, and we have to hold the things on one side. It's, it's not much what you can do. I believe according with the law it's about you have to you can you have to keep them like one year or something like that but not sure depends on the country depends on the law phone spa yes selling selling is probably more than uh, the repair business yeah definitely just get some stuff if you have like like a local warehouse, buy the cables with one pound, you sell them for five. You know, you earn like five times the price. You know what I mean? Charges the same. I didn't stay long with the, okay, with the XPS boards. Yeah, I, we found like few was working. We have picture. So all good, all good. I have 150 positive reviews. You see, that's, that's matter because when someone is searching, uh, you know, and it's close to you, they will you will get on the first page of Google. Jerry, good morning. But that's a problem, uh, Socrates. So. Uh, um, 
not sure what which is the the perfect recipe for uh, for this problem. I can't I can't say. What about our poll? Okay, so people are repairing stuff. So we can add all above above 37 plus 38 or Okay, that was a bad idea to add this all above. Only watching interested. So it's good to know actually 20% of the people are just uh, interested. Good to know. Calzone. Yeah, I, I love calzone. I love. You mean the one which is covered with the, yeah? With the, with, with the bread, yeah? Yeah, I love that. Like, yeah. And we do have a shop which is doing it here around, but not very great. What power supply do you use for repairing? It's a La Volta, La Volta BPS-305. It's, it's just a linear power supply, it, a basic one. Yeah, electro rep. Yeah, that's what I mean. It, it, very useful Google business. I wish I have Google business, but I, I don't take local jobs. Can we become rich in computer repair business? Uh, I'm not sure. I never been rich, but I never try to be rich. So if you have, if this is your uh, goal, yeah, to be rich, you have to be kind of like me. You have to, you have to have that knowledge to choose whatever it's worth to be fixed and whatever is not, and you know, just don't waste the time with something which doesn't worth to be repaired, or you know your chances to repair that thingy are very low. So if you are efficient and you get an, a, a, a good amount of, of jobs, then probably you can make nice money. I mean, the owner of the shop that he was making a lot of money. Yeah. He, we had days that we were we are making like 22K per day from a shop, 2,000 pounds per day. You know, th this is insane amount of money. Silvio, don't be toxic, man. What do you mean? Uh, there are people and people, and some people they have hobby to make money, and it's nothing wrong with that. Norwich is millionaire, it is. Louis Rosman is millionaire, it is. Sorry, it's 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 just a poor dodgy guy, it is. <laughs> uh, do you also sell laptops online? <sighs> no. Actually, this is the hard problem. I can buy faulty laptops, but it's hard to sell. In a country like UK, it's hard to sell. Can, can, you see? You see? Honest people. Our highest year was almost 2 million turnover. Two million in one year. That was a that was a good business can. Why is hard to sell laptops in UK? Because the the what the people get paid, yeah? You can get paid like let's say a regular person, it will get paid, they can buy a laptop in, in one day, yeah, with the money you earn in one day, you can buy a brand new laptop, brand new. That's the reason why it's hard to sell second-hand laptops. <clears throat> I mean, here is like something normal to earn like 150 up to 200 pounds per day. It's not unusual.
painful when you have to pay like two thousand pound rent. Well, yeah. <laughs> I will not choose that one, uh, Riddler Vibes. I will not choose 30 volts 10 amps. First is like, you know, when you're buying a motorcycle, yeah? So actually it's a very high, high chance, you know, to lose your life or something if you buy your first motorcycle, like big one, like one liter. That's why the beginners, and I see here the law is forcing the beginners to buy only up to like 125 or something like that. So if you buy a 10 amps power supply, you'll be, you know, uh, you'll have that wheel to use more current. So I believe 5 amps is perfect. I'm using 5 amps and I'm fine. On the other hand, you cannot really find, I mean, you can find linear power supply, like 10 amps one. But most likely what linear power supply you will find is like 5 amps. In my repair shop, the repair slice is only under 20%. Uh, Silvio, this is very strange because for a country like, uh, I'm assuming you are in Romania, the repair should be like a big slice of the business because people are willing to repair stuff instead of buying. So, uh, I'll be surprised. Hard to find, hard to find inexpensive linear power supplies. A linear power supply like my one should be around eighty pound. Peter, nothing it will happen. Who wants Windows 11 anyway? Good morning. They are forcing 11 down. <laughs> um, I mean, it's not bad. But I can't see something like, you know, okay, this is a lot better compared to Windows 10. Or this is better compared to Windows 10. Probably if you were waiting a little bit more, they will fix the bugs and... Yeah. Yeah, lots of a lot of people using Windows 7. Yeah, that's right. It's very simple. That's the thing. You have the old people. Like uh I had my 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 uh house landlord, yeah, which is a lady, probably I think it's over 80 years old. And she bought a new laptop with Windows 11 because the new laptop comes with Windows 11 and she did, didn't know how to shut down the laptop. That's the thing. And she came here and I show her and yeah.
Uh, Emil, uh, I really doubt actually that people are thinking about the environment. No, probably they try to save some money and not buying a new one. I don't believe that people actually care about the environment. Do you think the laptop exists in 10 years? Why not? Why not? We need computers. How do you install Mac OS using USB drive? Keep Alt key pressed. Yeah, you keep the Alt key pressed. And you power on the Mac. And you keep it pressed till you have the menu from where you, you can boot. Then you can boot from the USB. Then you format the hard drive. And yeah, that's all. The overhead camera is a Sony Alpha 6400. Guys, I'm uh, nearly ready with the coffee. What about you? Yeah. So like 20% of the, of the people are just, uh, you know, watching. They are interested. It's good to know. So the other 80% of uh, from the people, actually, they are repairing stuff. I'm ready for more coffee. No, I can't do it more. I can't. This is my third one. Too much coffee, too much coffee. Okay, I see a lot of people having questions about laptops. It's very easy, you go on our Discord and you ask this question on our Discord. Barbecue today? Uh, Didi is here. Ready for the comments. Barbecue, probably not barbecue. No, because I have to go with my daughter to the fly lessons, which was scheduled for today, like 3 o'clock. Which most likely it will get rescheduled. We'll see. What do you think about motherboard diagnostic flowchart? I never seen one done. What do you mean flowchart? My exactly. I'm not sure how you can do a flowchart because the laptops are different. Now we have mixed laptops. We have USB C and we have laptop with normal charging port. And both are both are different. Then we have laptops with the main power rail is actually the, the charger voltage. Then we have laptops, they have the main power rail from a dedicated power supply, like MacBooks. It's hard to make like, uh, you know, all well, the flow chart and you can follow. It depends on what you have on... Uh, reschedule again? I don't know. I'm, I'm not sure. I'm not sure. I mean, yesterday was nice weather and they reschedule. So I'm not sure. Can you trust the budget uh, stereo microscope from Ali? No, eBay, yeah, but from AliExpress is risky because you can lose the money. But from eBay, if you are not happy, the eBay it already found you. Uh, Sami, it's very easy to get tricked, like, <clears throat> you found one ohm on resistor, maybe it's one ohm resistor, maybe you check the resistance actually of the internal GPU, it's tricky with the multimeter.
Many of us come here for the inspiration, for parts they miss when they approach a repair. You know what, Silvio, that's, that's right. I mean, I've seen many people, uh, they have some parts, they understand some things, yeah? But they can't make the connection. Okay, what is the connection? And uh, I'm happy, you know, actually, you know, watching the videos and see how I think, what I do, they figure it out. I'm happy, I'm happy, I'm happy, you know, that other people can can learn. Uh, Jerry, probably not, probably not. <clears throat> I mean, just to start the live stream for one, two laptops is, uh, it's kind of short, you know, and, you know, live streams are like long, so not, not many people there are willing, willing to watch like hours of electronics. What is the most important tool for starters on electronic? You need like, this is a must, like a, a lot power supply and you know, solder iron. This is, this is a must, at least this, like solder iron, multimeter, power supply. Multimeter you can find cheap multimeters, that's not a problem. Solder iron you can find. What age do you get got married? Probably like 28, if I remember. Uh, Praga Shrao. Sorry, is so creative with forward and reverse diagnostic. <laughs> you know how many things I how many how many times I got it wrong? Nikolai, it's fine. You don't. You don't have to thank me. I mean, this this is your thing. You know what I mean. Just being able to progress. You watch a video. You gather some knowledge, and you move forward. Thirty volts, five amps is enough. Definitely. Yeah, that's what I have here. Thirty volts, five amps, and I have no problem. Near future, you'll continue the lessons with DD. Probably not. Nothing near. Nothing near. Brian, it's not for me, it's for my daughter. She has to do, because the school, the university said she, she has to get her uh, uh, private pilot license on the first year in order to move forward. So we, 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 have, to, we have to start from now. Do you get retail repairs? There are, like usual, like, like, uh, always, I post the retour repairs on YouTube. But yeah, I do. I do get probably probably under one percent. And no, I, I can I can see I can count them on the fingers how many returns I got. Probably like last year, under ten returns in one year. Did you ever get in a heated discussion with a customer? Yeah, I have one single customer from United States. For some reason, I didn't I didn't figure it out. Actually, it's from United States, and I give her the my address, and uh, 
after I finished, I done the job was a data recovery. So we we got on some point. Uh, she said, "My lawyer, she will contact you." That's <laughs> like, like, you know what I mean? <laughs> my single, ca- I, you know, I was looking to be proud about you know my my first and single customer from United States, but that discussion end like, okay, my lawyer, it will contact you. But we managed to we managed to. She, she thought I'm some kind of scammer. You know what I mean? And. Uh, uh, when I told her, okay, your phone is on, uh, it's working, it's all done. Just I need a password and I will get your data. Because if I send you the phone, most likely it will die. And from that point, everything started going wrong. And finally, she agreed to send someone from England. She comes to my door to check if the phone is working, and on that point, he, he pay me cash. You just to understand how stupid it, everything it is. On, on PayPal, PayPal has like a, a buyer protection. You know what I mean? I'm paying with PayPal. If I'm not happy, go to PayPal and ask for money back. But she didn't want that. Yeah. It was crazy. I mean, it, I, I believe it was the only customer which I got on this kind of discussion and over like 40 emails. And it was very stressful. Okay, do a video shutting down. Now do a video powering on. Now do a video charging. You know, at some point I said, you know what, I'm really sorry, but I don't have time for this game. You have people, uh, buyer protection. You know, I can't. I can't do just send. You know, make a lot of videos, send a lot of videos over the email. Yeah, something like that. Something like Karen. Yeah. But initially, initially, I thought uh, she. I thought you know she's trying to scam me because it was going over like, okay, send me the phone and I'll pay you after. Yeah, <laughs> it's like something like that. But no, I don't think uh, she. She tried to scam me. Uh, she just didn't trust me. Yeah. <laughs> It was quite a hard data recovery job. It was a Samsung phone. It was not easy. But the phone died once after I fixed it. So it was not It was not like, uh, okay, you know what? I will send it and you can recover the data because most likely the phone, it will die. But yeah, but the thing goes very wrong. And pro- probably, probably the customer had some, you know, sensitive data. In, you know, I don't know. I can't imagine. You see, like I don't know. You you don't know what the customer can have on the phone. They don't want to share the the password. But I try to explain. You know, I can send you the phone. You can recover the data. I don't care. But it's no warranty, which is kind of stupid because if. If the customer is paying with PayPal, has to be a warranty there. But yeah, it was a lesson what I learned. If I'm getting a data recovery, uh, I have to deliver the data. I cannot, you know, otherwise I will lose the money. But when she said, okay, my lawyer, it will contact you. My lawyer, my no, no, no. She didn't say my lawyer. My consul, my consul, yeah. And I have to search on Google. Like, what the hell is a consul? <laughs> Check on Google, lawyer. <laughs> like, like, what? Wait, wait. <laughs> uh, yeah. Ah, okay, guys. No, Roland. No, 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 no. Don't, don't, don't put a problem like that. Probably she was like over caution. <laughs> you know, she was scammed so many times. You know, when you are scammed so many times, you start not trusting anyone. Yeah. Now we get a job removing an answer. 
No, no. I know that virus, but I, I never had a job like that. Melly, good morning. Thermal conditions are for good. Yeah. Yeah, there are some term and condition on the website before you are booking in the... You have to agree with the term and condition. But on the end of the day, people don't care about term and condition. You know what I mean? And all the, all my recipe um, are with PayPal, yeah? I'm not asking the people to pay with the card. Because when you pay with the card, that's kind of, you know, okay. So what's going on? Why he asked me to pay only with my card? PayPal and the people they trust PayPal. That's why I'm asking the pay payments with PayPal. PayPal is more secure. It's not about the secure. But if I have a problem, I have someone which is listening to me. Yeah, Go in and open a case on PayPal and you have a people judging that case you know what i mean judging based on the proof they judge the case so that gave me trust in using uh, paper so same for the customer yeah look this is the invoice paypal invoice and the people they have trust okay i'm paying with paypal because i know if my laptop it'll gonna broke or it's no repair um Oh, I can get my money back. I had a customer like last week. Last week, yeah. With uh, I made a video with the gaming laptop. And the customer said, can you send me a picture with the laptop working? And I said, you know what? You pay with PayPal, you're covered. You have the buyer protection and, you know, I'm not a scammer. Whatever is going wrong, you, you can get your money back from PayPal. And on that point, he paid the, he paid the invoice. <laughs> Don, yeah, that, that, that's a classic scam. That's a classic scam. Microsoft uh, customer support, yeah. Uh, Brian, thank you very much. CO2 crisis today, CO2, watch out for CO2. Hmm. Don, Multimus from us. Okay, guys, so uh, we are, uh, we finished the coffee. Let's have a beautiful Sunday. What do you think? Yeah, let's enjoy the day. Huh? It's a climate joke? Okay. Okay. I will say uh, I'm happy. So the, the, the percentage of the people actually uh, just watching, interested, are 20%. So that means 80% actually are repairing things. Yeah, that, that's important. And we have 315 votes. Yeah. I will end the poll. But good to know, good to know. Thank you very much for voting. Uh, I will say have a beautiful Sunday. Thank you for being here, having a coffee with me. I really enjoy having a coffee with, uh, you know, people interesting on, on um, electronics and repairs. And uh, see you on the next one, right? I will upload a video with a MacBook today. Yeah, with a MacBook repair, with a crazy repair. Yeah, I will upload later. I have to edit first and I will upload it. So uh, see you on the next one. Bye.